Good morning, Vlogmas. Today is day nine. Jax dropped off at school. I put an episode of Daniel Tiger on for Benji. And I am going to knit for a little bit. The morning was not chaotic, but a little stressful at the end trying to get out the door. And oh, my car was covered in frost. One of the um one of the doors on the minivan wouldn't open from the key fob because it was frozen shut. So that's a first. We've only had this car since May. So it's our first winter with it and we'll see how it goes. I lost my slipper. Um, yeah, I, we had frost on the windshield, so that had to get scraped off. And we've had to do that a couple times, but today was the hardest it was to get it off. So there was like frozen rain on my car, like as if it had rained and then the rain froze after landing. So that was special. <laughs> But Jax is off to school. It's just me and Benji today. And I don't think we had anything going on. Um, other than I have a lot of cleaning to do. I have a lot of cleaning to catch up on. Um, let's see. I have a load of laundry in the dryer. That probably needs to be run again. Because it was my kitchen rug. A load of laundry in the washing machine. It's diaper day. So we have to wash diapers. I didn't do the dishes last night. I did clean the floor at least in the table. I think that's it. The first knitting. <laughs> So the sweater that I've been working on is a test knit for Mina Phillip, who is knitting expat on the interwebs. And it is a pattern that she is experimenting with a little bit. Uh, it is written as a regular pattern, but I'm not testing the regular pattern. I am testing the like customizable one. So basically she gives you an Excel spreadsheet that is already all laid out. All you have to do is put in your measurements and your gauge information and it calculates the whole sweater for you so you can use any weight of yarn you want you use your numbers as to how you want it to fit she does factor in some ease and if you want less ease or more you can adjust your numbers to that and it calculates it exactly to your size to your length to your bust to your arm length to your arm circumference if those don't fit normal standard patterns typically then this might be for you. So I'm not done knitting yet. I'm still working on my sleeves. I'm doing my sleeves two at a time because I'm using up all the bits of yarn. I ran out of every color so far on my sleeves. I've just used up what I had left. The tan, I have a little bit of wiggle room. I actually think I have a little bit of the green left too. That was like another extra ball, but I'm going to use up the last of the brown and then I'm going to rejoin my purple. That was my starting color and that'll be the end of it. So I'm getting there. I'm almost done. I have to get down to 16 stitches on my, uh, each side of my sleeve. So 32 around and I'm at, mm, I think 19 on each side. So 38. So I'm, I'm almost there. I'm getting there and I can't wait till it's done because it's going to be such a nice cozy sweater. This is high, uh, mm, I think it's haiku simply natural. It's, I don't remember the fiber content. I want to say it's wool, alpaca, and silk. I can't remember if there was cashmere in there too, though. But it's like super soft. It's, it's like a cuddle up on your face, kind of. <laughs> anyway, I'm stopping my knitting. I should have stopped more than 10 minutes ago because Benji's, na um, and I was going to say nap. Benji's snack should have been 10 minutes ago. But I wanted to get to a good stopping point. Um, right after my decreases. I didn't want to stop mid-decrease round and have to pull back again. 
So that's that. Let me go get this kid before he destroys the entire living room. He's in my yarn again. Let's see that car, Jax. Let me see it. Let me see your Christmas car. Wow. No, not on his hand. Hi, Boo. Mommy? Yes. Oh, thank you. I am done with my evening cleaning. I am about to go do some video editing, but first, let's open some yarn. I have no idea what this is. I definitely have to Google it. <laughs> let's see. We're getting some very green colors. Ooh, a little more green with some purple. Also has like a slight bluish hint to it. Ooh, I like this one. This is fun. Ugh. What am I going to do with these mini skeins? They're so pretty. My friend Anjanette showed us last night at Knit Night a sweater that was designed by Amba O'Brien, I think is what she said. Um, that was designed for mini skeins. But it's kind of a crop sweater, which isn't really my thing. I'm a little short-waisted and giant boobs, so that doesn't work on me. <laughs> so, I don't know. I'll have to look into that one. But I definitely... I'm going to have to use them in a project together because they are fading. 